krishna has got his external uh, energy called maya that is this material world or material energy this energy is specifically meant for a particular purpose what is that purpose that some living entities they are very rebellious they are against krishna so such living entities are placed in this material energy in the material world by krishna and when such living entities are placed in this material world then they are given a material body with a specific material name nama rupa and such material name and material body are not the original body or name of the living entities originally we are anama rupa anama means without any material name and without any material body or material form so whatever name and form we have now all of us is given by some higher arrangement of the supreme lord that arrangement also is being explained here that material nature is empowered to recreate again and again and again this creation takes place and then there is maintenance and then there is destruction again and again this happens so what is the purpose of this creation this is a big mystery why creation takes place so that mystery is explained in this verse that this creation is a chance for all of us to realize who is krishna what is our relationship with krishna what kind of relationship the relationship of love we belong to krishna we don't belong to this material world the creation is a chance for us to realize this to understand this and to revive our lost relationship with krishna 